Anson, would you tell some words about yourself as well? Okay. Um, my name is Anson Hui. I'm 15 years old. I was born in 1998, in December 3rd, and I'm a boy. I was born um, in North America, Canada, uh, Ontario, Markham. Anson, how did you decide to become a pianist? Well, my mom introduced the piano to me, and I seem to be doing quite rather fast in development, so, and I want to pursue this kind of career, or at least it's my uh, dream career. Who were your teachers? Uh, my teacher was, uh, uh, Edward, <laughs> Albert, <laughs> and, uh, uh, when were your first concert? I uh, don't uh, remember that. How old were you when you had your first concert? I think it was uh, six. Uh, what is the role of music in your life? Well, let's see. I think. The role of music really changed my life from because I'm like first I have to homeschool since because uh, I can't uh, I can't have enough time to practice so I have to homeschool and I have to go to Indiana once every month usually or usually uh, half the time I spend in Indiana to study with my teacher so I travel much more often than other people, I could say. I think that could be the difference. Okay. Uh, what is your favorite music? What is your favorite composers? Well, I think my favorite composer is Bach. Why? Uh, I think it's because it's neatness. Yeah. It's very orderly. Uh, because it has this, like, there's three books on one side and three books on the other side. So it's a very uh, balanced, uh, sort of like a very controlled mechanism or network. What is the role of music in your life? Well, for me, it's how I express my emotional feelings because usually I'm very logical about things. I guess that's the emotional expression of, of what I feel in my heart. Because basically, whatever you think goes into the music. So it's a special language. You talk with uh, people, yes? Yep. And what would you like to say to people? To which people? Uh, which come to a concert and listen to your music. Uh... What would you like to say to them by music? No, it's more of subconscious thing. It's saying things without words, so I don't know how to say it. Translate it, actually. Okay, uh, why did you choose uh, music, but not chess or, or mathematics or languages? Well, for music, I tend to be uh, more... It's the only time music I can express what I feel like emotionally. Basically, to to people, otherwise people see me a very logical person. Okay. Um, uh, would you tell some words about uh, your friends, uh, your lifestyle? My lifestyle. Yes. Well, uh, normally I get up with uh, uh, usually a tube or sort of a ping pong connected to here. Yes. So basically, after the feeding time uh, is done, then I get up and. I brush my teeth and I go to practice and then once in a while, every couple of hours I have to drink something called cornstarch, which is cornstarch mixed with water. I mix them and I drink it. I have to keep, you know, sometimes I give myself total ice feedings. Uh, do you have friends? Uh, yeah, uh, I do. What, uh, how do you spend your free time? Well, 
Well, sometimes I read uh, some biology papers, like uh, something called Mechanisms to Hematology I'm reading. And also sometimes I read Legos before, but now I don't have the time to do it. Because I want to play board games in front of people. Oh, okay, so the most your time you spent uh, with the piano, yes? Yeah. Usually. Yes, and uh, and studying new uh, compositions, yes. Yeah, I do study compos yeah, compositions. And uh, your uh, favorite composer is Bach. Yes. So a German, yeah. a German composer. But as for Chinese composers, I am not a huge fan of Chinese composers. At least in my taste. Okay. Okay. Uh, I wish you all the best, and so. Thank you for your interview. Bye.